our country is characterized by too much forgetting. One of our challenges is the need to ensure that our youth know where we come from. The African Oral History Archive is about being able to have living testimony so that future generations can get an insight into the human beings that were there so that my children and future generations can understand our history and our roots so that they can shape their own future. <laughs> No country uh, should feel itself free uh, while one single country remains under colonialism or any other form of oppression. I wanted it known that it was Winnie Mandela and not Mandela's wife. And I will show them that women are going to bring about change in South Africa, and we did. Use of color, use of tribe, use of different faiths, Resolve these problems of the continent. Make Africa what it should be. A black bishop who once told me, you are like a zebra. It wouldn't matter if the bullet strikes the white stripe or the black one. The animal as a whole will die. Our generation given a better chance in life because of the fight of our founding fathers. Thank you very much. And of course, Nelson Mandela is his willpower. You know, never give up. That is the inspiration really for Africans. It's important first to have that ambition. Ambition to say that, hey, we also count. Do not leave us out. That time is over. We are there. And this is our continent, this is our place, and this is our time.